some, that was some study of uh, 38 years uh, old male, young male, uh, the history of uh, pain in the epigastric region for the last few months and uh, feeling of heaviness. I'm showing you, uh, I have freeze an image so that uh, the time can be saved. You see, this is the outer margin of the cystic area. This is the cyst. I have placed the probe transversely in the epigastric region. And uh, here I see a cystic area with this strap of ecogenic area being the pancreas, where I've written P is suggestive of pancreas and the pancreas uh, measures 14.2 millimeter at the body. This is the body of the pancreas. And if you see in the center this tubular area, this uh, tubular area is the pancreatic duct. So the pancreatic duct is with the normal. The dimension of the pancreas is normal. The outer surface uh, or, the, uh, or the contour of the pancreas is a bit uh, muffled and uh, at, at areas, some areas, you can see this uh, ecogenic border, but uh, otherwise it's muffled, you know. And then here in this region, near to the head of the pancreas, the body of, or the neck of the pancreas is normal. This is the neck of the pancreas. It's appearing normal in ecogenicity. And this is the portal vein. And this is the aorta in transfer section superior mesenteric artery in transfer section and uh, there is another you know vessel this is a vessel tubular area and a coic that is traversing bet between the superior mesenteric artery and the aorta now this is the left renal vein this is the left renal vein so these are the landmarks uh, uh, that I, I have uh, I had to show you on a frozen image. The rest we will continue with the uh, ultrasound. The cystic area measures 9.8 centimeter by 4.3 centimeters. So uh, this is our case of study today. Now this is the landmark that we are really seeing the pancreas, which I also mentioned in one of the other videos, that this is the saplenic vein, this is the tail of the pancreas, so the, this, cystic, this cystic area, so it means that if you are seeing the saplenic vein, then we are seeing the normal organ, that is uh, our, uh, what I am saying is correct is that this is the pancreas, this is the pancreatic tissue. See the muffled outer margin of the body. Tail is okay. This is the tail of the pancreas. My age is approximately, sorry. Uh, 12 millimeter or 1.2 centimeter. This is the aorta. Now this is the cystic area. Now here you can see the thick wall of the cyst and the debris within it. This is the debris uh, or ecogenic uh, areas within this cystic, within the cyst seen anterior to the uh, anterior to the body of the pancreas as well as well as the tail of the pancreas. Yes, this is. See, this is the saplenic vein. Let's study the vascular anatomy. This is the this is the aorta. This area. This is the aorta. This region. And. Uh,
this is the superior mesenteric artery. This is the superior mesenteric artery, the aorta superior mesenteric artery, and this is the superior mesenteric artery in transfer section. Supplenic vein, this one, as a landmark for the identification of pancreas, this is a supplenic vein. Right now, This is the portal vein, extra hepatic portal vein. This is the extra hepatic portal vein in transfer section. So, what we are seeing is in fact a pancreatic pseudocyst relating to the body of the pancreas and extending up to the uh, tail of the pancreas. Now this pancreatic pseudocyst with the multiple internal echoes is, in, it, it, now we can say that this cyst relates to the pancreas. So that's why it's a pancreatic pseudocyst. Patient is on medical treatment. I wonder whether it, it will resolve with medical treatment, keeping in view the degree of uh, uh, ecogenic island seen within this uh, cystic area. These are the these are the ecogenic areas seen. All these are of ecogenic islands are seen at the medial end of this uh, cystic area. Now you can see septas. This is a septa. This line, ecogenic linear area septa. This is a thick septa. This is a thin septa. And there are few tiny calcifications as well in the ecogenic uh, islands within the uh, cystic area. So this is the study in transfer section. Now I'm going to move the probe to the longitudinal section in the epigastric region. So you see uh, it also relates to the uh, head of the pancreas. Now this is the IVC. This is the IVC and this is the head of the pancreas. Uh, cyst is involving the, sorry, uh, extending to the head of the pancreas because in transfer section, actually the head of the, this is the head of the pancreas. This area. This is the head of the pancreas. And uh, okay, then this linear structure, uh, tubular structure, is the pancreatic duct, which is not ionic. This is the pancreatic duct, and the head of the pancreas may. Uh, 2.14 centimeters is not normal in equigenicity. The contour is normal. Now this is part of the cyst. This area, from here to here, and from here to here. This and this is all cyst. Sparing the head of this is the head of pancreas. It's sparing the head of the pancreas. This is an equigenic island within it. Again, longitudinal study. Now, with uh, the use of uh, the Doppler, let me first focus the. Now, if you see, we can also study from this area. Let me apply some gel, a shot of gel. Yes, okay now. Okay. 
Okay. B I V C This is in fact the IVC, this area. This blue blue structure is the IVC. This is the IVC, this is the aorta, and this is the head of the pancreas. Head of the pancreas, normal cystic head. Here comes the cyst, and then it extends laterally. Receptor. and it extends into the lesser sac. In fact, this is the region of the lesser sac where we are seeing it. The cystic area is in the lesser sac, extends to le uh, towards the, uh, the left hypochondrium is seen above the tail of the pancreas. This is the liver. This is the gallbladder. Now, there are no calculi within the gallbladder, so However, the liver is fatty, fibro fatty liver, kidney is normal, this is the portal vein, this vein is the portal vein. So this is our case of the day that uh, relates to the thick wall cystic area relating to the body and tip of the pancreas, sparing the neck and head of the pancreas. This, this view is good. Just a review now, thick wall cystic area with internal ecogenic areas as well as septas and tiny ecogenic particles, the calcifications as you will name them, and the irregular outer contour of the pancreas. This is the neck of the pancreas, head of the pancreas, this is the, uh, uh, the pancreatic duct. This pancreatic duct is not dilated, this is a splenic vein, this is the uh, superior mesenteric artery, this is the left renal vein that is uh, crossing the uh, uh, superior mesenteric artery and aorta and then it will enter into the IVC which is its normal path. So this is the duodenum, this region duodenal gas shadows are seen. So this is our case of the day. Thank you very much.